Hey, what's up guys? You boys, Polly 2K7, and we are back for brand new Grand Auto 5 LFSPDFR episode. Today, we're going to be using coastal callouts and playing as a member of the United States Coast Guard and trying to rescue some people that are stranded on a cruise ship a couple miles off the coast of San Andreas. Now, you guys may be wondering why can't the cruise ship just come in and dock? Well, because of all the craziness going on with this virus, they shut down the ports. They're not allowing any cruise cruise ships in right now but we do have about five to six people on board that have positive symptoms and they're pretty much not doing well so we got to get them back to shore now we're gonna be flying this mh60 uh, jayhawk helicopter today our pilot is already inside here already pre-flighted the aircraft and we are ready to go now um this thing is pretty far out and it is moving away from us so we are gonna have to try to get there as fast as possible hopefully it's not too far far away by the time we uh, get there. Let's start taxiing out here. And let's actually, let's go towards the left. We really don't need much space to take off. So we are clear. And we'll just take off and follow the runway ahead. And we are up and the ship should be somewhere in that direction we don't have it on our map yet we're just gonna have to fly visual and see if we can find it hopefully they didn't drift too far <laughs> like I said they are moving they're moving at about 10 knots so we should be able to catch up to them but I'm just not sure how far out they are that's, that's just really I'm gonna check the part We do have nice and calm seas today, so that is good. That should make this an uh, easier rescue. Right, I'm just going to keep going in this direction until something pops up. And we'll get here on the camera here in a little while and see if we could pick them up. So far, I don't see anybody or anything. Oh, here we go. We have a, that's not what we're looking for though, that's a cargo ship. this ship guys where the heck are they all right i'm gonna switch to our camera here and let's just see if we can pick up anything i got another cargo ship there not what we're looking for though oh this is gonna be hard to find guys say a sailboat see anything I'm gonna just set a marker for about right there and let's just continue flying out yeah it would have been nice if they like kind of stopped and not continue driving but um yeah guess we just gotta deal with it <laughs> keep seeing these um, cargo ships keep getting me excited I'm like nope that's not what we're looking for there's another one alright so this is definitely going to be a little bit hard guys like I said we don't really have an exact location I know it's somewhere in this general area though but I really don't know where oh my god we can't even see them the map anymore. I don't even see San Andreas anymore, guys. And 
guess these clouds aren't helping either. Let's go ahead and lose a little bit of altitude. Alright, so what I'm going to do, I'm going to let my pilot fly a little bit. And I'm going to just work the camera. Whoa. Did somebody fall out? Is he good? Why did it sound like somebody fell out of there? You good, bro? <laughs> okay, we're good. Alright, I'm going to work. Oh, here we go. We got it. We got it. We got it. Alright, we are here. We gave up a little bit too early. Perfect. We are here. Actually, I was like almost on the money where I put my marker at. Alright guys, so we found it. Here is the ship. Queen Mary 2. That is what we are looking for here. Alright, let's try to get into a good area where Got to gain a little bit of altitude here. Okay, looks like they're signaling us. They want us to try to lower ourselves right about there. a nice cruise ship. Any of you guys ever been on cruises before? I know like right now is not the time that anybody wants to be on a cruise, but like I enjoyed them. I've been on um, four cruises before with Royal Caribbean. I always had a great time. Alright. So let's go ahead and get into position. So what we're going to do is move to the right rear. And I'm going to tell my pilot to just get over the nearest pets. Actually, probably, eh, yeah, pets would be okay. Alright, perfect. Let's get our hoist. Alright, so we're going to try to lower ourselves right onto the deck of the ship. It's, it's rare to see like the deck of the ship that's empty. Normally there's like thousands of people on here enjoying the sun and then the pools and the slides and they have like a track. Some people just like to walk through the, through the tracks and stuff. It's, it's crazy. Hey, how you guys doing? Alright guys, so we have two deckhands. These guys are just going to help me out if I need them. Everybody that we're going to be transporting is over here. Another deckhand, he just has the information for all the travelers, so we'll make sure we'll take that from him. This is going to be just the names and I guess the passports of the people we are taking off the cruise. Let's let our crew know that we're going to need a basket and let's send that first basket down. All right, ma'am, you're going to be first, okay? Pilot's doing a good job just tracking this ship. I know it's kind of hard to tell, but we actually are moving right now, too. At about, I think we're only going about five knots still. All right, so let's get her inside. All right, got the first survivor coming up. All right, she's at the door. Let's bring her in. Perfect. Send that right back down. So we have one person saved so far. Let's grab the next lady.
Nice and easy, nice and easy. Alright, second one's going up. We may need another helicopter too. I don't know if I'm going to be able to fit everybody inside, but we will try our best. Alright, that's two in. Number So I think that's what for now, right? We got two more people. We may have to bring another helicopter for the other two. Alright guys, so I have a second helicopter coming in to take the remaining two people. My helicopter is just going to be standing by over there. Here's our second one. So now I have two helicopters overhead. Actually, I want to see something. Oh, they already switched to this one. Where's the other one at? I think the other one is above this one. Alright, so let's see how this is going to work. Let's enable the hoist on the second one. So this is going to be the second helicopter here. The other first helicopter is hovering above this one. Alright, let's see. Where's the remaining people? I hope nobody fell overboard. Or missing somebody. Okay, no, he's up there. So this thing has like a shake every now and then and all the pets go flying all over the place. Where's that high up? One more person and we could get the heck out of here. Uh, 
There's the second helicopter. Wait, did the other? I think the other helicopter may have left. So we probably have to get a ride back with this one. Inside, we're gonna now get rid of the basket. I don't know why it keeps making that noise today. What is happening? Alright, let's take this last guy. Let's get the heck up off this ship. Oh, oh, that's what I was talking about. That kept happening to us. This guy is coming up. Now the next thing is going to be figuring out where the heck is land at because I cannot see anything in any direction. I think we just really have to go north. Well actually I could just follow the waypoints back to the police station. That would basically take us back to shore. Alright, so let's see how these guys are doing back here. So we have two of the six people that we rescued. The other four people left in the first Jayhawk. So let's get them to the medical center. Alright, let's get that rear door closed. Also get rid of our hoist. Clear that wave point. Look how far out we are though guys, like let's see. We are really far, oh here it is, right over here. So we are going to take these guys to the hospital. And goodbye cruise ship. That was a very interesting rescue there. We had these two helicopters. We had a little bit of glitches with that um, cruise ship model. Like from time to time, I'm not sure if the helicopter was hitting it somehow. Like maybe it has like a weird collision above it. But it kept like banging around and it was like making us fly all over the place. I'm actually surprised that nobody went overboard. Well, I went overboard a couple of times. But yeah, besides that, I'm surprised that none of the other people went overboard. So let's get these two back to the shore. The first four already arrived at the hospital. Hopefully all six of them will be able to recover. Just make out the land in between this cloud formation up ahead. It's crazy how far out we are. Nothing around us but water.
All right, I'm trying to lose a little bit of altitude here as we get ready to fly over the airport. Make sure we avoid the arrivals and departures. Or somebody explode. I'm happy that's not me again. If you guys remember what happened in yesterday's episode. Okay, so we're going to be landing at the Davis Medical Center. Now, I have to remember to update my um, Lenny's mod loader. So because of that, some of the props are not loading prop. And it looks like we had a crash. Ah, that sucks. <laughs> I wonder why it crashed. But um, yeah, like I was saying, um, I have to update Lenny's mod loader because it's not reading some of the props that is used with Costa Callout. So like, there's normally like a bigger and better helipad that also has like really cool air socks you could. Uh, tell the wind, speed, and direction, which is very helpful. But unfortunately, since the plug-in crashed, normally what would happen once we touch down here, the ha hospital staff would come out um, and take the patients inside. But since it crashed, they're not going to do that. So it's a little bit unfortunate, but it is what it is. But yeah guys, hopefully you did enjoy the episode, try to do something different. We haven't really used that cruise ship mod in forever. I think I used it a couple of years ago if I remember correctly. I don't know, I always wanted to do a video with it, but I, don't, I think I did one before. Maybe I didn't, I don't know. But hopefully you guys did enjoy it. Thank you so much for watching. If you did, make sure you guys go ahead and smash that like button. Leave some comments down below. Subscribe if you are new and I will see you guys in the next one. Thanks. <laughs>